All right. Let's everybody just relax for a moment. Take a deep breath in. Feels good, right? I'm curious. I'm curious. Who here knows everything? For those of you that raised their hand, man, I feel sorry for you. I mean, because just think about it. When you believe you know everything, recognize that you're actually handicapped because now you can't learn anything. So it makes sense to just let go, relax, open your mind, and get curious. You know, when you talk about mental health issues, emotional issues, one of the things in my past is, you know, I grew up without my dad around. And I imagine that some of you guys can relate. And so what I used to do was collect father figures through sports, coaching, men that I looked up to and who I believed were a good example of what it meant to be a successful and good person. And it's really interesting because I'm just curious, I live in Kansas City right now, and so how many of us have seen The Wizard of Oz, right? Okay, because this is something that a coach once imparted upon me. Now, you guys have all seen the story, but perhaps you never thought of it like this before. Dorothy's in a crisis. All of a sudden, everything's a vivid color now. She's surrounded by all these little people. What is that about? And who is that lady? Why does she look like that? And her attitude, that is not, what is she yelling about? These shoes, you know what? I've had enough. I just want to go home. I just want to go back to Kansas. I don't want no parts of this. Believing that she herself didn't have the ability to experience life the way she wanted to, she started asking everyone else, where should I go? Who, who can help me? How do I get out of this? Somebody said, you know what? Go see the wizard. Go follow the yellow brick road. If there's anybody else out here who has exactly what you need, this is the guy, I promise you, he can help you get it. Believing that she couldn't, get this result for herself, she just went down the yellow brick road. On that journey, we met those three characters. One doesn't think he's smart enough. One doesn't think he's got the heart or he's tough enough. One doesn't think he's got the courage. So with this thinking, they all go down the yellow brick road. Overcoming all kinds of stuff. Trees came alive, flying monkeys. Dorothy got past that to get to the wizard. And what did we learn? There is no wizard. Dorothy, if you want this result, if you want what you want to go home, you're going to have to make it happen. Girl, you're just going to have to take some action. So now she's thinking, why is that to be so hard? Well, I, I don't want that much. I just want to go home. Am I stuck in this situation forever? And then Coach just paused. And looked at me. And he said, you're in Dorothy's shoes. What are you going to do about it? You're in Dorothy's shoes. Why were Dorothy's shoes so important? Because she had the power in those shoes the entire time down the yellow brick road. But she recognized now that it wasn't until she learned the basic instructions of how that power works that she realized that I do have the power to be, do, and have whatever experience I want. Recognize something. You don't know what you don't know. And what you don't know is what Eric's doing his best to impart upon you. It's what you don't know that you don't know that's running the show called your life. And think about this, guys. For those of you who know everything, since you don't know what you don't know, how do you know what you believe you know is right? Open your minds. Get curious. What am I missing here? Because think about the Wizard of Oz, guys. Those three characters, in the end, it was all a dream. It was all in her head, right? So recognize those characters weren't real. That's how Dorothy felt. 
Like she wasn't smart enough, tough enough, or had enough courage. How many times have you felt like that? Don't answer me, think about it. You don't know what you don't know. And with what Same Here Global is here to impart upon you today, is to open your mind. For all you know, what you don't know that you don't know that I know that I'm about to tell you could change your whole life, but you're too busy talking. Guys, girls, every one of you are perfect. You have parents, you have a dad or a mom, but they're not you. They've never felt your pain, they've never felt your joy. And one day you're gonna have a son or a daughter who's walking around in your high heels, wearing your jewelry, acting just like you. But she's not you. She's on her own journey down the yellow brick road. All of us are just like Dorothy. Sometimes we feel like we're not enough. It's not true. You don't know what you don't know. You're perfect. You have never existed before. You are a once in human history experience. You've never existed, therefore you can't be compared. You are perfect as you, and the world can't get that energy from anybody but you. So what do I do when I'm not feeling empowered, when I feel like the scarecrow and the lion and the tin man? Open your mind and get curious. What don't I know that if I did, I would feel better? What don't I know that if I did, I would feel better? That's what we do with Same Here Global. It's to open your mind up to whatever story you're telling yourself about why I can't or I'm not, it's not true. You just don't know what you don't know.